Utica Police Department is rolling out a new protocol to handle loss or abandoned dogs found in the city. Our Luke Radel visited police headquarters today. He joins us now in studio with our top story. Luke, good evening. Good evening, Jason. It's every dog owner's worst nightmare. What would happen if my furry friend got lost? Well, here in the city of Utica, there's a new plan in place to ensure that lost or abandoned dogs are treated safely and humanely. I spoke to Utica Police Lieutenant Michael Curley about the lost dog protocol. So recently, the city and Wanderers Rest, located in Canastota, New York, have come to an agreement about housing dogs that we find in the city, whether they're loose, abandoned, or just running loose and things of that nature that we have picked up with our animal control officers or our patrol officers. So with the investment through the city, we've installed new secure cages and, and kennels within the police department facility here. We're really trying to make it the best environment for the dogs. We know that they're here for a short period of time. Now we're trying to have no more than a 24 hour hold in which we can locate the owners, hopefully return those dogs to their owners. But if not, we can transport them safely and humanely to the Wanderers Rescue in Canastota. And as he said there, the new kennels and cages are only meant to be temporary placements for the dogs. The police department only has room for about half a dozen dogs at a time. I got a chance to see three of their very friendly dogs, a black and white shepherd mix, a brown and white pit bull mix, and a brindle pit bull mix, all located on May 29th, according to the UPD Facebook page. The department says they've all shown great social tendencies and have had no issues in their care. They are up for adoption. Messages like that are on the social media as part of the department's plan to keep these dogs in safe and loving homes. First, they advise anyone who spots a lost dog in the city to call UPD using the number on your screen. The dog will only be brought in if it can be secured by animal control officers and the owner is not located. Then the reunification process begins, including efforts made on social media. Pictures of the dogs currently at UPD can be found on their Facebook page and Jason, they are all very cute. All right, Luke Radel reporting for us tonight.